Hi Libra and welcome to your May 2016 reading. My name is Joanne Cobus, Josie K, and I'm doing a reading that includes a multitude of decks. Um, yeah, it's a lot to look at, but it makes sense to me. And if it's connecting with any of you, please leave me a message and let me know how it's working out. Um, I'd love to like extend more information through me from the spirit guides for you to, if you need some answers or guidance. Um, so um, to start with, I laid out some cards from the gateway uh, to the divine tarot. And um, the first two cards I pulled were the chariot and the world. Um, <clears throat> that tells me that you want to run and jump through this circle and go into maybe a brand new world. Just race right through the middle of there and maybe even toss someone on that chariot with you. Um, who knows? Right now, um, I kind of went down different readings for each of those cards. Now, if you look at the chariot, the chariot wants to go, 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 but feels like the Eight of Swords stuck. Making the right judgment, whatever that means. I mean, that could be like I see buildings in the background. Or no, those are pipes, music. Oh, that could be like almost resurrecting friends that you haven't seen in a long time. Maybe a different part of yourself is coming through. If you can cut loose, you're having a hard time getting far because you're having issues with money a little bit, just a little tight. And the world card says you almost want to fight or sneak towards this Queen of Cups. Okay, and she can be a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio. So I went down a little further, and there was a Knight of Cups, or Coins, that um, popped up. Now, a, a Knight can be somebody at work, and Coins can be an Earth sign, Virgo, Taurus, or Capricorn. Um, something about a path that you need to think about with regards to... A job offer I think because it's an ace of cups your foundation is the six of cups so you're doing okay but there's something to think about right now it says have faith um, I'm going to pull one of the oh I already did all right, the Empress, Archangel Gabriel. Lavish abundance, give birth to your dreams, and nurture others. Okay, well, that's odd. Lavish and not doing so well. Angels, please explain. I'm thinking that you're stuck in a path at work right now, and you're fighting, and you're just annoyed, and maybe this Queen of Cups is a part of that and now you're being offered a new path open your heart and mind around those trustworthy and heartfelt devoid be trustworthy compassionate respected and cultured it's normally a love card maybe you're meeting someone who's a queen of cups through work That'd be Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio. Too much work. Maybe someone's coming into work. That could turn into something. Confidently accept opportunities at work. So there's your answer to whether or not you should take that one. Stretch your wings and fly. Don't underestimate yourself. Assert your independence and your creativity. Need we say more? All right, so a lot more about career is what I'm getting here. Um, yeah, it's the Empress. Nurture yourselves and others around you. Make a judgment. Watch your cash. There's a good choice of money that you should probably take should it become an opportunity. All right, 
Next, I pulled cards from the Gilded Tarot, and the first one I pulled was an air sign like you, Aquarius, Libra, or Gemini. And they're racing in. They're racing in to fight this battle against an air sign, Aquarius, Libra, or Gemini, or maybe dealing with a child. That's of those signs or just... causing issues. Then you have the Six of Wands. Hold on. Sorry about that. I have kids. Need I say more? Okay. Um, yeah. Started out with the Knight of Swords, racing in to deal with this battle that's involving another air sign or a child that's feisty, Aquarius, Libra, or Gemini. You come out with the Six of Wands victoriously and you are standing on your empire meaning you have a pretty solid base so that's all good the angel card said about that reading to have great inner strength release harsh judgments and have forgiveness and compassion for others that could have to do with work or love you know these readings are just hard to cover so many people so you have to kind of grab with what you hear and if you hear a good one get a hold of me at my email which is josieK42 at gmail.com all right we have a king of wands fire sign Sag Aries or Leo and he's looking at a queen of wands who is kind of looking like she's being bossy and then you have a king of swords looking at the ace of cups i think that's you again male or female looking at this ace of cups either offering love or thinking about a water sign i don't know why i'm getting that pisces cancer scorpio down below is the ace of pentacles so maybe a king of wands is someone at work who is sitting on a good path and there's going to be a celebration um, kind of bummed because back here at the end then, something you wanted to create, produce, and put forward, got that. So, should something fail, try, try again. That is what you do because you'll only come out with better stuff. Okay. I'm going to ask the angels to provide us with a card to clarify a little bit. Dear Spirit, Lord, Spirit, Guides, Angels, and the Dear Lord in Heaven, please bless these cards so that I may provide a clear and accurate message for Libras for the month of May 2016. Okay, be outgoing, creative, confident, and even a little mischievous. News of an exciting new endeavor. Okay. And that's done by these. So I think... If you let that first thing go and you whoops <laughs> and you try try again the path is going to be there and this says exciting new endeavor page of fire just remember be outgoing creative confident and and you can't be mischievous you can get away with that right now for some reason be good okay upside down at work with the rider weight Full circle, full circle, something's coming, uh, queen of cups, there's that queen, there's that water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, and hopefully a happy home. Happy home may be your outcome because I looked at a few other things, it was about money, maybe we can ask the angel cards for one more card for our closing card, please angels, bless us with a clear and defined reading clearly defined okay hmm. ego if events flow too quickly i think we talked about this take time to clarify to review your options to have creative solutions you may have to try more than once Events will be moving at a, a fast pace. Your delays will be over. 
and the eight wouldn't be eight days I don't feel I feel like eight weeks around that time your ego will be what knocks you down your ego will be what gets it because there's a false sense of entrapment negative or fear-based thoughts it's the fear-based thoughts that are getting in the way of this which is causing this so if we keep being magical in front of our ego we will produce a new path and maybe even with someone so Libra I hope you enjoyed your May 2016 reading and have a nice day